this is you. And this is Vancouver, the most beautiful place on earth. Sea levels are rising, and this will affect you, Vancouver, and the rest of the world. Well, not this much, and not this fast. Sea levels will only rise one meter by the year 2100. And I don't want to talk about Vancouver disappearing in a thousand years. And you won't be happy to hear that this one meter increase is going to have you swimming around the seawall instead of biking on it. First Beach, second and third, Granville Island, the airport, many parts of Richmond, and so many other places will be affected. This is Greater Vancouver. These are the industrial lands. And these yellow spots are farms, where our food comes from. Want to see what happens if the ocean rises? Oh my god, that's a disaster. No farms means no food, and this story gets worse when a tsunami or flood happens. But what's the solution? Sea walls, sea dikes, scour protection, some other boring stuff? Are you angry? You should be. No beach means Vancouver is boring. The great parts of our solution are represented as using dynamic shorelines instead of boring dikes, transforming oceanside agriculture into ocean-friendly agriculture. Dynamic shorelines. It has two main parts that can be used independently anywhere. First part, floating shorelines. The beach level is regulated when water level rises because of any reason. Also, it can generate energy. The second part, dynamic dikes. These dynamic dikes will smartly adjust their height based on sea level. Agriculture transformation. Should we always stand against nature? Why not let the sea cover the land in some parts and take advantage of the nature-made low-depth basin? Aqua agriculture. Fish, algae, marine plants, rice, and hydroponic farms. The pros. Generating biofuels creating food security, environmentally friendly, and lowering risk during flood and tsunamis. We've taken advantage of these ideas and have developed an action plan for each coast of Greater Vancouver, including farms, industries, historical and environmental sites. If you liked our ideas, please go to this link and vote for us.